guys, so I wanted to do a quick video today. I'm still not on location, but I'm just kind of winging it with these short videos. I want to show you how another method not mentioned to get your Pine tab online. And you can also use this video to get any device online, especially one powered by Linux. You can follow the same. So what I have right here is a Wi-Fi connection. You may not have an Ethernet uh, place that you can use an Ethernet. You may not have a Wi-Fi adapter. I just happen to be in a location where I don't have any Wi-Fi adapters with me. So what I've done here is I've connected my main laptop to the available Wi-Fi. And what I've done is I've attached a very affordable around $10 Ethernet that is USB powered. I have this little converter here for the USB-C because it does not have the other USB uh, port on the pine tab so you'll need a USB-C based so you'll want to use this here down here is for charging only this is for data and so what I've done is I plugged in this ethernet adapter I've attached the ethernet to my pine tab this way then I've ran the other side to my laptop which has a Wi-Fi connection now once you have that Wi-Fi connection you have the ethernet adapter installed and the other end of the ethernet hooked to your laptop or other device. You could also use this method to uh, have your Pine phone or other device online. And what you'll do then is for the ethernet connection, uh, you connect to the Wi-Fi or whatever method of connecting you'll use for your main uh, connection. And that will provide the internet data. And then for the wired or ethernet, you'll edit that connection to the pine tab using an ethernet connected to the laptop, other end connected into this ethernet into the pine tab. And then you'll go over here to IPv4 settings and you will simply select this shared to other computers. You'll save your connection. And at that point you will have provided the Wi-Fi based internet over through the ethernet up into the pine tab and you'll have a wired connection here as i've shown on this short video clip so that's another way you can connect your pine tab online and i'll have more videos coming out related to the pine tab linux and open source make sure to share the video like it and subscribe and i'll be back later with more videos on the pine tab